Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. In this video, we will move further in the bottom navigation view. In the recent video, we have created this material designing bottom navigation view. Now in this video, we will work with its fragments and understand what is backstack. Now for that, go to bottom navigation view. Now go to the bottom navigation that is class and it is the design or the bottom navigation view which we have made in the last video. You can check out the recent video for this. Now I already made some fragments. Now if you are new here, please do subscribe and if you don't know how to make fragments then go to new creates and create fragment. Now give it a name that is a profile fragment and finish it. All right. Now go to the design. Now inside the design, we will design it little bit. Now change it with the relative layout. Also change its text and right here profile. Also add some attributes that is text style bold text color that is black let's align it in the parent bottom and its height and width to be wrap content all right make it center horizontal true and text size that is 20 sp Now we will add one image view that its width and height to be 400 dp. Now add source that is profile and also align it in the center. Now that's done. Now this is the design which is similar to the other fragments you can see here. Go to fragment, go to design and you can see that's similar. Let's change the size, text size that is 25. SP. Now our fragments are ready. Now we need to inflate it or we will switch these. Now go to design. Now inside this XML, we need one container which can handle all the fragments. Now let's add one frame layout. Height and width to be match parent. Now align it above of the bottom navigation view. Now you can see it here. That is above bottom view. You can see here. Now it's a container give it an id that is that is parent container now here our all the fragments will be switched whenever you click on the icons all right now let's go to the class now inside the class let's first of all fetch the views that is bottom navigation bottom navigation now let's fetch it by using find view id that is bottom view all right so we need to load the fragments so first of all we will create one method with the name of public boolean load fragments all right now inside it we will pass the fragment whichever the fragment we want to inflate or switch now here we will use the fragments that is its component called fragment manager with the help of that we will begin the transaction and switch the fragments so first of all let's check the fragment if the fragment is not equal to null then with the help of get supported fragment manager dot begin transaction that means we are beginning it now inside it dot replace now here 
our frame layout that is parent container here that will be removed with the help of or we can say replace with the help of the fragment which we are passing through this method and the fragment and we need to commit it all right it's done now let's set the item selected listener or the navigation item selected listener so go to navigation view dot set down navigation item selected listener and pass the reference variable as a this so all right for this we need to implement the bottom navigation view interface so go to implements bottom navigation view dot on navigation item selected listener so all right whenever we implement the interface we need to override some methods so override one method that is on navigation item selected now inside it we will switch the fragments so first of all take one fragment instance that is fragment is equal to null initially all right now we will use switch case now inside it with the help of item we will get the id now we will add some cases that is home id now you will you can see these home ids are the menus ids that are the icons which we have added so don't get confused here you can check the recent video for it now we need to create the object of the fragment that is home fragment and we need to break it all right copy paste it three times and changes according to fragments and change its ids now we need to return the load fragment method with the and we will pass the fragment what are the fragment which we have switched so let's call the load fragment in the on create that means whenever the application is open home fragment will be selected so let's try it now you can see the output these are the fragments which are switched but in this case suppose when i press back it will exit you can see see it exit that means it doesn't maintain the back stack so in order to maintain the back stack means we need to add the fragments into the stack so that whenever we press the back button we get back to the recent so add back stack and null pass it null so let's try it again now you can see search settings in the profile now we press back it will back to the settings search home and it removed it here now the stack is empty so let's try it again search settings and profile now back but you can see here icons are not selected so let's take one reference example of there is one app which is phone pay so we will try to make maintain or back stack like this so let's see first of all remove the add stack add to back stack now we need to implement the or override the back stack method that is on back pressed so now you can see here that when i'm switching the fragments here now i back press it get back to the home not exiting that is it back press on back press it is getting back to the home fragment so let's see how we can build it so if let's add condition that is bottom navigation view dot get selected item id now here we will add the logic that if the selected id is equal to the home id that is the first fragment then we will call the back pressed and finish the activity that is fragment and it will exit the app otherwise we will set the selected item as a home id all right when we ever press back button it will get back to the home id now let's try it 
now you can see here see you can see both the outputs that are similar now whenever back press it will get to the home fragment try it again so hope you guys like this video if you haven't watched the recent video please do watch for this otherwise you will not get it so please do subscribe and share thank you